In this segment, you will learn how to perform a structural bumper repair using Fuser 142. Benefits of using Fuser 142 include one product for all structural bumper repairs, cures fast, permanently flexible. Because TEO is one of the most difficult plastics to fix, we chose a TEO bumper cover to demonstrate our Fuser repair procedure. Begin the bumper repair procedure by cleaning both the front and the back sides of the repair area with Fuser plastic and rubber cleaner, stock number 703. Next, sand both the front and the back of the damaged area with a DA sander using 80 grit sandpaper. When sanding, remove the paint from the damaged area. Taper the damaged area on the Class A side leaving rounded edges rather than a V-groove. Blow away dust and debris with compressed air. Do not wipe sanded plastic with solvents as performance issues could result. Next, apply one light coat of Fuser Surface Modifier, stock number 602EZ, and allow to flash for 10 to 15 minutes at room temperature. Now, we will prepare the structural reinforcing patch using Fuser Bumper Reinforcing Mesh, stock number 700. Cut the mesh to fit the back of the repair and round off the corners. It is important to note that prior to using any two-component adhesive, seam sealer, or foam, dispense a small amount of material from the cartridge to ensure an even flow of both components. Then attach a mixing tip and dispense a small amount of material until uniformly mixed. This is a key step in all repairs. Apply Fuser 142 to the back side of the Fuser 700 plastic membrane. Then attach the Fuser 700 bumper reinforcement mesh on top of the adhesive. Saturate the mesh with additional adhesive. Apply the patch to the repair area and smooth using a spreader. Allow to cure for 5 to 10 minutes, then remove the membrane. Next. Begin repairing the top side of the bumper. Apply Fuser 142 to the front side of the repair area and smooth with a spreader. Fuser 142 will skin over in about 90 seconds and is sandable in approximately 20 to 30 minutes. Now sand the front side of the repair using a DA sander with 80 grit sandpaper. Then finish with 180 grit sandpaper. Blow off dust and debris using compressed air. If necessary, use Fuser 114 as a skim coat putty over Fuser 142 to repair pinholes or sand scratches. Prime and refinish per the paint manufacturer's recommendations. This completes the structural bumper repair procedure using Fuser 142. For more information, visit www.lord.com forward slash fuser. Call 877-ASK-LORD or contact your local fuser distributor.